Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be good. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Houston, Texas, weighing in at 251 pounds. of everything Booker T has earned. Countless titles, a crown, a scepter, and a Hall of Fame ring. Nothing left to prove, but still up for a good fight. That's what I'm talking about. You know, I really hope this referee is motivated tonight because I'm pretty sure this match is going to turn into a brawl and fast. Well, here comes a hardcore wrestling icon who is indeed ready for a brawl. And his opponent from Truth or Consequences, New Mexico. Weighing in at 287 pounds, Cactus Jack. He's been covered with thumbtacks, nails, barbed wire, been lit on fire, been broken in half. And yet Cactus is still standing and ready for whatever else you got. I sure hope he is ready about to throw hands with one of the toughest fighters in WWE history. When it comes to unpredictable superstars, Cactus Jack has to be right at the top of the list. There's no telling what this man will do once the bell rings. Cactus Jack delights in letting his imagination run wild in the ring. As long as it causes destruction, there's no object he won't try to use as a weapon, and no risk he won't take. In some ways, you have to respect Cactus Jack's no-limit style. It can make him a very challenging opponent to contend with. Well, he better be ready to learn because Booker T is going to teach him the code of the streets. You don't question Booker T's credentials. Booker... The sleeper hold is cinched in. Time to go night night. Sleeper hold. I mean, how do you get out of this sleeper hold? What can they do? Look at this dream reversal. That's one way to do it. I can't imagine what goes through a competitor's mind as they stand across the ring from Cactus Jack. They're probably wondering if they've updated their will lately. Cactus Jack, the cover. ends the count. He's still in this. Elbow drop. Piercing. Kick to the gut. Pump handle applied. Pump handle slam. This match grinded him down a little. He heads outside. Count out's legal in this match. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Uh oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. Shifts it back onto him. Harlem sidekick. This is a very serious looking Booker T right now. Punishing stretch. That could produce a dislocation or at the very least a pinched nerve. Okay, he's re entering the ring. Book saying, You want some sucker? Come get some. He's positioning himself, closing in. Look out! What? And that was a collision you don't want to be on the receiving end of. Came down like a wrecking ball on a cinder block. Oh, man. Booker T is feeling it now. Jack felt that coming. And he's taking this to the outside now. Yeah. 
Reigns down an elbow in retaliation. Say good night. Sleeper hold is a pl Sleeper hold is cinched in. Oh my goodness. Not for long. Booker T getting the crowd involved here. Okay, already we get it. Stop looking for adulation for the crowd and get back into the fight. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. Gotta hurt. Having a weakened arm can limit you in so many ways, making it harder to execute on even simple attacks. That's a big win right there. And I'm going to check on a... Oh, hold up, hold up. The, this superstar... No, oh, come on, this is uncalled for! Now, what does this prove? Don't blink or you'll miss Nathan Frazier. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Jersey in the Channel Islands, weighing in at 182 pounds, Nathan Frazier. Nathan Frazier in a short time has already proven to be one of the best high flyers in all of WWE. And he's also proven he'll rattle everyone's cages and tell some hard-hitting truths. I like this guy. Well, this is a must-see kid of WWE. And his opponent from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 183 pounds, Wes Lee! Lee always has the heart of a champion, no matter what. Michael, we have seen that Wes always fights through adversity and faces any problems head on. Wesley has acquired his target here tonight. Guys, this is going to be fun to watch. X marks the spot for Wesley. First man up tonight is Wesley, who has really shown his mettle recently, overcoming a lot of personal and professional obstacles. Resilient doesn't even begin to describe him, and that's not to mention what he can do in the ring. Wes is truly a special kind of athlete, well on his way to becoming a top competitor in my not-so-humble opinion. He certainly has all the tools to reach a bright future. And his opponent is the young Nathan Frazier, who's from way up, diving double axe handle. 
Looking wobbly in the corner. And Wes's counter. Bulldog! Delivered with force. Chop. Followed by a drop kick. Oh, my! Wow, belly to belly. Uh-oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. It's a lot of risk involved with the offensive style of Nathan Frazier. Yeah, but there is a generous reward to be had with that risk. If Frazier can stay focused, he'll greatly reduce the risk associated with his offense. Trapped in the corner. Chops and punches in the corner. He can do it here. The better part of Val. Look out! Oh no! Crashing hard onto the floor! I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might. Up high! Through the air! And connects! Big time risk pays off! The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. Bam! Super kick! Oh, caught him in the head! This powered them up. No, here come the punches and breaks out. I mean, this has been a physical battle since the get go. It has been everything we have expected. This superstar is rocked, and this superstar apparently has decided. Is that had enough? Actually, gonna leave the match? You can't be serious. Time to walk away and fight another day. Certainly appears to be the case. Wait a second. Maybe oh, not. Oh, oh. This just went from bad to worse. Corey, why did that superstar just throw them back in the ring? Your guess is as good as mine, but right now it's time to plant your feet and throw hands. Well, look out. Whoa, a spiral tap. Cannot finish Nathan. Did it, but he's hanging in there. Just how much pain is he willing to endure in this match? That was plan A, and it didn't work. He must be thinking about plan B at this point. Oh, he's looking to completely render this leg useless. Stump puller leg snap, very effective. Oh, God, what an elbow. Great reaction from Wes. Just carrying the opposition anywhere they want. Oh, right across the throat. Nathan is undergoing a thrashing. Nathan keeps getting cut down. Right on target with a stop to the gut. Dodged right on cue. Round and round into the... Satellite DDT. Carefully measured knee drop. Oh, man, Nathan is bleeding now. We might be close to the end. Maybe just stay down, man. You've done enough. And he needed that badly. West showing how hard it is to fully shut him down. Looking for a high-risk move. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. From the top rope, counters. Oh, costly error there. Wes showcasing his strike. Wes is determined right now, looking unfazed. Flip, flip, DDT. Cover. Two. That's it. Wes able to score the win. Here is your winner, Wes Lee. They refuse to let the disrespect get to them, and now they are standing tall. Definitely kept their head clear in this one.
It just goes to show you, disrespect can be a grand motivator. Maybe not intentionally, but look at how it fueled them to get the win. That's the kind of edge they need to keep going. They need to keep the chip on their shoulder. Get ready for a technical clinic. Expect nothing less from the Hitman. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Weighing in at 235 pounds, Brett the Hitman Hart. This is a man who's fought and crawled his way to the top. Bret Hart has proven he can put anyone in their place, and he has no problem doing it. Make no illusions about it. Bret is the hitman for a reason. Cold, methodical, precise, as tactical and technical as they come. This is the man who has really brought pride and prestige to the Intercontinental Championship, but he's not content with that being his ceiling. The sky really is the limit for the hitman, and the WWE Universe knows that. side of the ring, but he is all business in it. And he has made that painfully obvious time after time. Big LG has worn many hats in WWE, but this is his ultimate form. Yeah, believe it or not, one of the few superstars that actually chokeslammed Kane. A man of many names, Luke Gallows dead set on being mean and making green tonight. Few people have achieved the kind of success Gallows has in every corner of the world. The big man has... Waist lock applied and countered into an arm drag. He went right into that turnbuckle. Luke keeps him away. There's the crucifix. Nicely done. Oh, he retaliates. He skirts away, living to fight another day. And Gallo's able to reverse that. Oh, across the top rope. From the apron. He paid for that one. Oh, man, big time. Paying the price of treating your own body like a human crash test dummy. Uh-oh. Hitman never saw that coming. Oh, God, that hurt. Oh, this is going to hurt. Just a barrage of elbow drops into the chest. Unleash 
unleashing a barrage on their opponent. The competitive spirit is alive and well in this one. Yeah, I think these superstars were actually fairly eager to test themselves against one another. That means they recognize each other as being legitimate threats to their own ambitions. Caught with the boot. Oh, right on the arm. Not good. Now he's been put on the defensive. Dropping the elbow. Placed in the corner. Boom! What a right! Torturous focus on the leg. Ooh! The legs are a base that you do not want to lose. Chopping down the tree at the base here. What a counter! These two having an answer for everything. <laughs> Textbook fireman's carry takeover. Power slam incoming, no. From behind him with inverted DDT. Rocket kick. He had it scouted. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Taking flight. Splash! That was more splatter than splash. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Just cranking the head. Sudden cutoff from Brett. Knee strike connects. Go for the arm bar and up. Just stretching out the arm. That attack was definitely pre-calculated, hoping to greatly diminish the power in that arm. Denied with an elbow. He catches Gallows with a big counter. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Ow! Foot, meat, back. He's on his heels a bit now. Yeah, Hart knows that now is a time where his execution has to be flawless. Knee right to the midsection. Punch right in the head. Kick to the gut. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Luke Gallows looking to go skyboard from the top. Target in the stomach to reverse that maneuver. Here it comes. Looking for Choke Slam. And he slides him back to the mat. Shoulder in the air. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. Able to sidestep it. Pick the leg. Oh, man. That'll tear your hamstring. First with a waist lock takedown. Ooh. Ooh. Ow. Loving blow to the chest. I oh, had that well scouted. Oh, driver spiked him. That's gotta be it. Uh, celebration begins. Enjoying the victory here tonight. Opponent, obviously a sore loser. Well, Cole, I got a feeling this story is far, far from over. Sign me up for a rematch.
WWE Universe just exploded. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 295 pounds, Ryan O. Everyone in this match is competing at such a high level. I predict one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. One of those damn Dudleys is at it again. Who knows what we'll see tonight. And his opponent, representing the Dudley Boys from Dudleyville, weighing in at 269 pounds, Devon Tons of tag team goal, but more than ready to fight on his own. Oh, the collection plate is out, and he is ready to punish the sinners. Doesn't matter if he's fighting alone or with his brother. Devon will beat you up all the same. Now, Devon is more than happy to put folks through tables all on his own. Heck, maybe he'll put one of us through one, too. And you are looking at one of the most unshakable superstars on the roster. Absolutely a picture of resilience. He's been through ups and downs, but has never given up the fight. Bitter perseverance is what will make him such a threat in this matchup. Yeah, but he's fallen into the crosshairs of Devon Dudley, a man who has lived the word extreme to, well, it's extreme. How eloquent, Saxton. But you're right, there's not a shred of fear when it comes to Devon. A participant in the first ever TLC match, it's hard to imagine where the tag team division would be without the influence of Devon and his brother from another mother. Out on the apron. Oh, this is gonna be bad. This is gonna be really bad. Back suplex on the apron. That was worse than being hit by a cinder block. Into a flapjack. Impressive. And Devon didn't find a counter for that. Right to the knee. Ooh. Delivers the knee. Shot after shot, then slamming their face down. Solid punch. Toss back into the ring. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. No one likes a count out. Hits him with the counter. That'll turn your lights out. Eight. Can he score the pin? Oh, uh, maybe. No shoulders up at two. Couldn't quite slam the door yet. Oh, using the knee as a weapon. Saw that coming. He was waiting for him to make his move. Planning on what to do next. What a throw. I don't think people realize the amount of strength it takes to hurl someone like that. Into a flapjack. Impressive. Oh, this is what's this gonna be? Wheelbarrow! Oh, put down face first. This match may be nearing its limit. This is getting hard to watch, guys. We might need to stop this one. Ah, what a hamstring. That was a vicious display. You can almost see the disdain in their eyes. 
Devon now trying to capitalize. Uh oh. Oh, uh, Devon got caught with the reversal. Belly to belly suplex. Devon now lacking any signs of resistance. Devon's getting exposed. here what are you guys thinking obviously not about the rest count Cole Black Jack. oh look at the cripple the leg he's feeling the effects of that last hit Continues to from the top. Elbow drop for the win. And he only stays down for a one count. These one counts are gonna get harder and harder to kick out of. Devon with a kick to the guts. Turns his opponent around the saving grace. Can Devon end this? Makes a cover. was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for him. Hey, it might be time for a change of strategy. His Devon points to the pull and drive from down with saving grace. Devon could have this one. Two count. Well, that was a hard-fought victory there, and uh, opponent's pretty hurt, I think. Certainly hurt, but this superstar wants to inflict even more punishment. Now, come on, what's the point? A little reminder. What an egomaniac. Things are about to get good. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 224 pounds, John Oxley. Looking out at the countless members of the WWE Universe in attendance, they are all here because of matches like this one. He is in perhaps the best shape of his career, and he will need that with the competition level this high.
Here comes the new world order. And his opponent, representing the NWO from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 212 pounds, six. From the main events to the title wins to spray painting their territory, the new world order letting the entire WWE Universe know where the power lies. They will take any shortcut to win, attack any competitor in the locker room without warning, but you cannot deny the results. They took over WCW, and now the rest of sports entertainment is next. You walk around the backstage area, there are countless superstars who would love to don the black and white of the NWO. It's better than the alternative of getting beat down by them. Good point. What are you expecting from this superstar tonight, guys? Well, he did say earlier that he's going to attack his opponent with a renewed hostility that we've never seen before. Yeah, he also said he's going to make the competition beg for mercy. But don't even think about counting six out of this matchup. If you do, it's only a one, two, and a three before you regret it. Mistake by six. Oh. Look at this. Snap suplex. Oh, that was just malicious. Insulting. That's gonna fire you up with anger. Vicious forearm right to the skull. We know that Six loves to keep the pace up, loves to keep moving. Surely we'll see plenty of that here tonight. No, we definitely will, Cole. Six has almost unlimited stamina. The guy never runs out of batteries. He's been placed in the corner now. Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. Nice striking combination. And he said, you're not getting me with that this time. Great counter. Back drop suplex. Six slowed down there a bit with that one. Just disrespectful. So this could also light a fire under you. Make you fight even harder. Just rubbing salt in the... Gets his shoulder up before the two count. He is going to take this match as long and as far as he needs to. Here's the cover. Gets the shoulder up at one. Strong kick out, but you have to wonder if he can keep it up. Unbelievable athleticism. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn things around in a hurry. He's one step ahead there. An elusive six there. Brutal stomp to the body. And followed up by another to the chest. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. And he goes for the pin. No, he pops the shoulder before three. Close call. That was almost lights out. Hold on a second. He might be finding a submission hold here. How do you escape the abdominal stretch? Like that. Quickly hoisting him up. Snap pile driver. Off into the pin. Two. Here is your winner, John Oxley. 
not for lack of trying, but six on the losing side here. Speed, agility, precision. Six had it all working for him tonight. Yeah, but sometimes your opponent has more working for them. All right, I love this guy. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from North Carolina, weighing in at 218 pounds, Kenny Omega. This is someone I can give my full support to. Someone who has the guts to stand up for what's right. What are they, a knight in shining armor? Give me a break. A man who always gets a strong reaction from the WWE Universe, and it will only intensify once the bell rings. Here comes the Scottish Supernova. An accomplished superstar who has made his name in NXT and WWE. And his opponent from Ayr, Scotland, weighing in at 178 pounds. Supernova 11, no Noam Dar, the first ever Israeli-born WWE superstar. The Scottish Supernova has done Scotland and Israel proud. The only man to hold the NXT UK Heritage Cup Championship more than once. That's a testament to the pure wrestling skills of the Scottish Supernova. Highly skilled. He's the first Israeli-born superstar to compete in WWE. He's got a, bit, a little bit of his own swag going, too. He's smug. He's not smug, Cole. He's confident. And you can sense the anger emanating from the competitor tonight. Eyes like a blazing fire. This is a man you don't want to be in front of right now. He's a man possessed is what he is. But Noam Dar has only gotten more ruthless lately, especially when the pressure is high. And for Dar, the pressure is always high. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. 
Looking for the arm, looking for the arm! Fujiwara arm bump. And gets to the ropes, that's going to force the break. And Noam is countered. Back and forth, back and forth, looking for the advantage here. In the face! Back and forth we go. And finds a counter. The fight is on, and it's furious. Neither competitor is backing down. And Dar turns it around. This is a war of attrition with neither superstar wanting to be the one who surrenders. Oh, man, what a combination. Can you and he goes for the pin. Manages to escape before the three count. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Slips out of the way. Well placed elbow to break up the maneuver. Springboard off. Finds room and lands a jawbreaker. Takedown. Oh, helicopter spin. This is ridiculous. This is insulting. This is entertaining. Disgusting behavior. There was no respect shown there. Norm down position. Running in Segari. No, I'm ending this fight right there. Man, oh man, what resilience. He's got to be running on instinct alone. And it may just take going to the well one more time with that maneuver to gain the pinfall. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. To the arm. Uh-oh, this is just vicious. Man. No, I Break his arm. Vicious. Looks like Noam is wavering a bit now. Oh, caught by the back elbow. German suplex. Gets inside the ring. This is what you call high risk. High reward. He needs to find his way back into the ring. The count just keeps going up. Taking flight. Oh, the high risk doesn't pay off. A terribly risky move, and it did not pay off. Icarus could have done it better. Uh-oh. Suicide dive. It's like a heat-seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. A counter answered by another counter. Switches it back around. A knee drop. Just caught all of that with his face, and now Dar's opened up. These men have shown no indication of staying down. Their gut. Riding the opponent down to the ground. Grounded down. Reverse counter. Nice knee. Oh, reverse back elbow. So precise. Noam Dar channeling every ounce of attitude with that yes. offense. The noise surging through this arena is ridiculous. Step up in Zagiri on the mark. Will that clinch things for Noam Dar? Noam Dar really making a statement with tonight's win. This was Supernova 11 doing what he does best, blasting off into a whole new stratosphere. And the competition simply can't keep up.
Ladies and gentlemen, here comes the phenomenal one. A man who exceeded all expectations in WWE and is now a first ballot Hall of Famer. The following is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the OC from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ Styles. I think it's appropriate to say things are getting just too sweet. One of the very best to lace up a pair of boots. Plenty of titles and main event wins here in WWE. Yeah, he's known as the face that runs the place for a reason. We are living in the almighty era. And his opponent from Colorado Springs, Colorado, weighing in at 273 pounds. The total non-stop action television champion, the almighty Bobby Lashley. Guys, Bobby Lashley has a physique that's carved out of marble. Yeah, Michael, when you look at Bobby Lashley, you see an absolute freak of nature. And it is almost impossible to stop this runaway train. Bobby Lashley has wasted very little time putting every other WWE superstar on notice. Bobby Lashley is all about discipline. The son of a United States drill sergeant former uh, serviceman himself, high impact personified. Here we go with the phenomenal AJ Styles in the ring. No question about it. AJ is a singular talent in a league of his own who has left an indelible mark on this industry. Over the course of his career, Styles has been the leader of impressive factions and a constant innovator inside the ring. His dedication to being the absolute best and surrounding himself with top talent has kept him on the cutting edge. I'm sure AJ is eager to show us that he's as phenomenal as ever here in this match. Lashley is a direct communicator with his words and his actions. His goal is to hurt people, plain and simple. There won't be a way to escape what's to come. I expect Lashley to come out of that corner looking to maul his opponent. Fireman's carry, neck breaker. Answering oh. back. Suplex. There he goes, right into the corner. Oh, catapulting down on the opponent. Quick thinking from Lashley. Draped across the top rope. Clubbing four. Great way to disorient your opponent. Oh, check out this power. This is ridiculous. Dominance. Power slam. The competition did not look impressed by AJ's acclaim there. Such physicality from Lashley. He saw it coming. AJ Styles, of course, known for his athleticism and tenacity. But Corey, what's the biggest key to success for the phenomenal one here tonight? If I have to 
choose just one aspect of Styles' game, Cole. I'd say it's that tenacity you mentioned, that pit bull mentality of Styles. At the end of the day, that's into the cover. No one kick out for AJ Styles. Very close. Fatigue clearly set again. What a barrage of stops. Lashley is doing whatever he wants. Bobby's just too massive to maintain. Laying out with a power slam. Incoming. Crash landed. Power bomb. That power bomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Styles a step ahead. Carefully placed stop to the arm. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, I think Lashley put all of his might behind that. He was definitely not thinking about finesse with that one. He was only thinking about dominance. Gets him with the counter. Styles doing what he can do to hold on the beatdown. Could be a chance for Styles to change the complexion of this match. Neckbreaker. He thinks he has it. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. And Lashley saw it was coming. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Lashley is laying siege. Crumble at the feet of the Almighty. Establishing complete control. AJ Styles looks like he's really struggling under pressure. At this point, it might be too much for him to recover from, Cole. Oh, man, AJ Styles may be wishing he was back in Japan around now. Styles will rally. Relax. Out of the way in time. Oh, drag. Very nice. Oh, look at this. Oh, pump handle. Oh, a gut buster. Styles stepping through. There it is. He hits it. Styles clash. Lashley's in dire straits. Lashley absolutely displaying the will to stay alive. You got to think frustration must be mounting for Styles right now. against Lashley now. And there's that tenacity of Styles, that pit bull mentality shining through. He's not gonna be the one to stay down here. Let's remember that AJ Styles is no stranger to adversity. This isn't his first setback. Good point. It won't take him long to bounce back from this.
And here they come. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 439 pounds. The WWE Universe has been counting the days, hours, and minutes for this match to start, and the countdown is almost over. The WWE Universe just exploded. The American Nightmare Cody Rhodes looks as ready as ever for action tonight. He's finally been able to tap into that, and we are now witnessing his full capabilities. Indeed, Corey, the American Nightmare has become a reality. For everything Rhodes has accomplished during his tenures in WWE, he's made his mark across the wrestling world. Every promotion he stepped foot in has been transformed for the better, thanks to the American Nightmare. But we all know he's got the best work ahead of him here in WWE. It's time to stand up and show some respect to the future of WWE, Seth Rollins. what's best for business. Oh, more like the man who sold out, who proved he cares about no one but himself. Well, it's lonely at the top, Saxton, and that's exactly where Rollins wants to be. And when the architect has his sights set on something, it's only an inevitability. Sometimes it can be hard to tell just how good Seth Rollins really is. But he really is capable in the ring. We've seen that before and we'll no doubt see that tonight. Well, I'd say he's more than capable. Rollins believes he's on a whole other level. And it's hard to argue against that.
There's the bell, and this tag team match is now official. Two very talented teams here, but it takes more than just that to succeed as a tandem in WWE. You have to be completely in sync to rise to the top. Figure trying to find a way out. The pressure is reversed. This is agonizing. Targeted the lower body there, and it was highly effective. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Close fist connects. He turns it around. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Down with the bulldog. Oh. No, one of the most dreaded maneuvers in all of sports entertainment. Verna Breaker. And into the count. Two. And still hanging on. At this point in the match, that could have gone either way. Getting him into the corner. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. He's looking a little off balance. Rhodes causing damage, causing harm. Then another. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. The springboard attack fails to land. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Oof, saw it coming and hit him with a shot to the face. Scooped up. Snake eyes in the corner. Big boom. He thinks he has it. Dying a two count there. Staying in this one. Look ringside now, guys. This manager is doing something very suspicious. The American Nightmare with the Alabama Slam. I do not see this match going on much longer with too many more moves like that from them. You have got to be an elite physical condition to pull off something like that. Just going all out with every blow. <laughs> Tagged with a punch. What on earth is coming next? And that was a precisely measured attack. A uh, heel hook. Look at this. Oh, that's so painful. It's hard to watch, too. There's no way this is going to work. No way. Oh, yes way! Suplex delivered! He's taking some good hits. Cody building his attack brick by brick. And here's a cover. Only a one count before the kick out. Those one counts getting harder and harder to kick out of. Went into the corner now. Tag, Tag made. We've seen some great chemistry from this team here, Michael. Yeah, incredible chemistry. Toll hold on oh, the elbow on the back of the neck. Teamwork making the dream work right here with that display. Goes into the pin. Two. What? Oh, he kicked out. He got close there. It could be do or die time. Oh, the elbow connects. He gets tagged in. Shot after shot. Oh, ruthless striking. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Running elbow drop on target. An earth shaking power slam. Able to get there in time. Rollins has a mark. Nasty kick. Just disrespectful. But I guarantee they're going to take great umbrage with that offense. Oh, I missed you. I wanted to knee you in the face again. Drops the hammer. 
Right on the lower back. He has a right where he wants him. Look out! Bailey! Oh, okay, what? Took a massive risk, but it might have paid off. Rollins firmly establishing the upper hand. And Rollins cannot be stopped. As you can cut it. They're playing with fire here. Across the top rope, all the way to the floor. Gets tagged in. And it's over. Big tag team win there. Here are your winners. The team of Seth Rollins and Cody Rhodes. Falling victim to the ref's count. This one is over. Not the win they wanted, but it's a win nonetheless. Oh, 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 are you guys ready? The following contest is a triple threat match. Making his way to the ring from Tampa, Florida, weighing in at 200 pounds, Rogers Rick Storm. And guys, this looks to be a match with major implications here in WWE. Could change the entire landscape here. He said he'll steal the show here tonight, and he looks more than ready to deliver on that promise. They're on their feet for Johnny Wrestling. And his opponents, first representing DIY. From Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 199 pounds, Johnny Gargano. Gargano has a never say die type of attitude, and that rebel heart is always beating. Well, you can't keep him down for long, no matter how hard you try. It's time for Johnny Wrestling to show the world why he earned the nickname. And I cannot wait to see it. From undesirable to undeniable to action figure immortality. 
Cody Rhodes is here, but that peck has seen better days. Son of a plumber is here and ready to finish the story. Flesh or plastic, injured or healthy, there's nothing that will stop Cody Rhodes on his road to glory. The WWE Universe is on their feet for this action figure. American Nightmare. The American Nightmare is all kinds of pumped up for this one. Underneath that hard plastic shell beats the heart of a true competitor. Cody Rhodes is ready to fight. Triple threat match underway with the opening bell. One more superstar to account for. One more eye to have in the back of your head. Any strategy you might have had going into this match, it's time to throw it out the window. Oh. DDT! Planet. <laughs> the defensive elbow to the gut ends that. <laughs> Springboard roundhouse. Good night. And Gargano saw that coming. The American Nightmare showing his power, Alabama Slam. You have to be in peak physical condition to pull off a move with that much weight behind it. It rose his counter. Check this out, guys. Double underhook coming. Byron's going to love this. The Dude Buster. That was the most dangerous position for any competitor to ever be in. You got to hope there was no irreparable damage done. Triple threats are known for being unpredictable. How do you account for that in the moment? You cannot let opportunities pass you by. This is not the time to shrink from the spotlight. This is the time to take it. Oh, saw it coming. Using the ropes. Looking for something, anything under the ring. Grabbing a kendo stick. Any connection with flesh will definitely leave a welt. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. And he's able to reverse. For a good punch. measure. Oh, and that one busted up Johnny. Into the corner he goes. A perfectly placed target. Cody retaliates. Big knee to the midsection. And he's out of there. And here he goes for the win. Frustration might be starting to set in. Running Bulldog. Headlock applied and a nice short jab to the bridge of the nose. And that holds Cody back. Swinging the elbow to halt the offense. Opponent dropped in the corner and mud hole stomping. Oh man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Out of the ring, what's his plan here? And now with the kendo stick in hand, he's ready to do some real damage. He's able to fend off the attack. Whoa, no! A slingshot cross body! Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. Reversal, can they go on the attack? And he gets delivered back into the ring. Dodges the attack just a smidge quicker. And gets tossed back into the mat. Planet. Bam, what a 
slap. Uh-uh. That's going to be a moment you want to forget it very soon. Oh, knee drop. out of the way. Uh-oh. Look out. Oh. Simple but effective. Oh. Rhodes showing his opponent how confident he is. He's reaching under the ring for anything useful. Up on the turnbuckle now. And he's able to counter. First. Good lord, what a shot. Someone's got to get control of this thing. Johnny Gargano sweeps the leg, rolls through. Oh no, this is not where he wants. He's flailing, desperately trying to get out of this situation. Oh, great counter. Letting his opponent know he can take on the world right now. Big knee to the midsection. Going for it. Going to step through. The pop oh, flips the lever, shoulders down. They are deep into this match, and you have to think that their stamina is running out. Yeah, at this point in the match, it starts to feel like you're fighting in mud. Whatever's playing here can't be good. Oh, just bounce that face like a basketball. Getting set up for something in the corner. No telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Baseball bat with a what? Here it comes, guys. Look at this. Oh, my. Boston Crab. And, and he breaks the submission. Uh-oh. Cross face. Can you imagine what it would do to him? And he rolls him off. <laughs> Rhodes denies the attack. Make it over. Oh, beautiful. Oh, what a close line. Moves outside. What's the plan here? Rhodes tied that one. Down on the ground, getting pummeled by that hammer. They'll take things into the ring. Oh, what a shot. Really swinging wildly now. Getting carried around. Bad spot to be in. Oh, right to the throat. Oof. With the lariat. He's going for the pin. This could be it. There's some shock in the arena after that kick out. And did you hear the impact of that? Right in the face. My God. He has been here before, and he knows what he needs to do. Oh, dropped on the crown. And they get over. Standing sheer noise. Leave a mark. What now? Goodness! Inverted suplex! Oh, oh, oh. We're undoubtedly nearing the end. This is a pairs of cover! Could be it. Got it! Survive the triple threat match! Here is your winner. Rogers, Rick Storm! What a performance. Huge win here in this triple threat match. We knew these three would put on a show, but I do not think anyone predicted just how intense this match would be. I think one man did, and it's the one currently celebrating his win.